So he clicked on this video to find out if magnet fishing is illegal. And that's probably because of all the negative press that it's been getting at the minute. With articles such as Bomb Squad warning over magnet fishing. What is magnet fishing and why is it dangerous? Guy reels in massive bag of guns while magnet fishing. Especially this article where it says boy of 12 pauses with loaded sawn off shotgun after pulling it from the canal while magnet fishing. So the trouble is the media are after selling stories so they'll dramatise everything. So yeah, magnet fishing could be dangerous if you um, take risks. Like I've took risks in the past. I've got in the canal to retrieve items which I totally don't recommend but that's the risk I take. If, I, if something happened to me I wouldn't have died because of magnet fishing. I would have died because I took a risk of getting into the water. So what's more concerning is the Canal and River Trust keep using a story of a father and son who died. Martin and Jack Andrews died, unfortunately, while they was out magnet fishing. No, I don't think anybody knows the exact um, circumstances of how they died. But the Canal and River Trust keep using them um, two poor blokes as, as an example. But if you go on the Canal and River Trust site, it will tell you that 138 people died of drowning just from walking or running along the canal path. So unless they're going to ban running, then um, unfortunately people are always going to drown on the canals, which is always unfortunate. Even like Manchester, um, 76 deaths um, just in the in this uh, city centre alone. So the Canal Trust also quote a bylaw, 41. And if you read the bottom, it says basically you're not allowed to dredge or remove coal or other material from any canal. Material, um, that's a total grey area. Obviously, coal, stone, that's material. But what about physical items, stuff you recover, like weapons, bikes, stuff like that? So the Canal Trust is saying it's technically illegal. So everybody who I've spoke to who've come into contact with Canal Trust people, um, they've never actually been fined. Nobody's ever actually um, been prosecuted for it. I think the main thing is to be considerate. If you're going to go out magnet fishing, you need to be clearing your rubbish up because the last thing we need is even more bad press. Um, But we need to do our best to keep the canals clean. So let us know in the comments um, what you think will happen in the future. Do you think it'll get banned? Do you think they'll um, make it licensed so we have to pay money? Which may happen. Um, Our government love to uh, make money out of us. But yeah, let us know in the comments and uh, I look forward to replying.